Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome to the channel. My name is Tiang and today I'm going to be sharing with you guys the time I bleached my hair and it fell off. Um, so this video is going to be like a two-in-one because I'm going to show, uh, tell you guys about that. And then I'm also going to show you guys how I got my hair to be jet black like this. It's not this, not, it's naturally not this black. So last year when I was in high school, I had decided to dye my hair purple. The inspiration behind this decision was this girl called Justine Skye. You might know her. She's a singer. Um, I thought she was so pretty. I thought, hey, if that looks good on her, it might look good on me. So I went ahead, I went to CVS or Walgreens to buy this dye. Now this dye, I did no research about it. I bought this dye, it had a bleach. So in order to like get your hair to be purple, it had, you had to bleach it so it becomes lighter so the purple can be more visible. I didn't care. So I bleached my hair. When I went to school that day, I got so many compliments and my self-esteem went way, 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 way up. And I was just... I'm feeling myself. 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 I was like my confidence was boosted because you know so many people liked it. Um, but that all went downhill. Once, like after two weeks, I noticed like natural hair, like forcey hair, naturally sheds, but it's never like an overwhelming amount. But the bleach weakened my hair to the point that when I just like combed it, it was like a lot of hair on the comb and it just started falling out and I just had to cut my hair again. So this hair that I have right now is a result of that incident. So this is like, that was like my second big chop. Um, so yeah, so this hair, this length is like a year's worth, a year and a half. <laughs> Anyway, so now I'm just about to show you guys how the process and what product I used to um, get my hair to be black again and a review on the product a little bit. I just went ahead and sectioned the hair off. So let's open the box. Oh my god, this is the actual color and then this is the thing to activate the color. Apply color to hair from roots to ends of the thin sections. You, you can't stop me. You will never get a wrong beat. Just when it looks out of reach, I respect like one three, like one three. That's when you smile in my face. What are you at in my place? What are you at in my place? What are you at in my place? I know you at. Do you see the difference? I don't trust the words you say. How you want to click up at the end of the stage? Look you in the face and it's just the same. I don't trust the words you say. Look you in the face and it's just the same. You guys, look at how black and shrunken my hair looks. I love it. I love it. So, about to go in the bathroom right here and wash this off. Um, oh my goodness. I really hope I don't look like a grandpa, but yeah, I'm about to go wash. Wash, wash, wash. I can't. Uh, Look, y'all. Okay, so a quick review on this product. It's Clairol and it says texturizes and tones. But when I first saw the texturizes and tones on it, I thought, oh lord, it's about to change my texture. But that didn't happen. Um... So it's designed for women of color, and I'm a woman of color. So I was just saying, okay, so designed for women of color, I'm definitely getting this. And then it also said, designed by African American stylists. So that was just a plus. So that's why I got it. 
anyway so i really i would really recommend this product for like if you're looking to dye your hair and i think they have other um colors that are not black so yeah thank you so much for watching this video be sure to like comment and subscribe i really really appreciate it i'll see you in the next one deuces